everyone and welcome to the next section of iz1 songs so this time it'll be five five or six music videos today of iz1 and we're getting to the and iz1 is definitely one of my favorite groups like i said um in the previous episodes i just want to go through them pretty quick because i really want to listen to them again and i'm just having fun with it so violetta is the music video that i probably like like it's definitely one of my favorites i really like i really enjoy it it will be one of the good ones. So after this song, there's about four left today, four or five left today, and then probably I'll finish reacting to IZ1 in like mid-October. I'm just gonna flip between a bunch of groups and stuff like that. So without further ado, let's just get right into Violetta. I really like the color scheme in their outfits in this one. Looks really good. Definitely one of my favorite music videos of theirs. Flash song. Super freaking pretty, and the song is so good. I really love the color scheme in this one. Violetta. And look how synchronized they are, it's always so great. Freaking love it so much. Those zoom ins and all the color schemes and stuff, and look at that synchronization, that's amazing. I freaking love it. The colors, everything, the aesthetic of the music video, like, look at that scene, it's so badass. Like, the water, it's like so well produced, dude. It's amazing. I just really, really love the song and the music video. Definitely one of my highly rated, one of my highest rated IZ1 songs for me. Man, I freaking love that song so much, dude. Like, it's one of, definitely one of my favorite IZ1 songs. It's amazing. I love it. The freaking girls, of course, were pretty. Clothes were amazing. Color was awesome. It was so well produced, dude. Like, the special effects, the colors, like, the camera movements weren't too intense. The song was amazing. Like, the sets were awesome. Like, the flower petals are, like, whenever she's dancing in the hallway with the water. Or, like, or like those little things dropping down on Sakura or with Chaeyoung and stuff like that. It was awesome. I loved it a lot. And then Choi Yena's stuff as well was really great. Just overall, just one of my favorite IG1 songs. It was, it's amazing. All right, wait, ratings wise, I'll probably, I'm probably going to go back and change Oh My to a 9.6 and make this one a 9.8 because I feel like that I like, um, I want to say I like you a little bit more, but it's definitely in my top tier for iz1 it's amazing and i just wanted to go through it because i really wanted to listen to 
the IZ1 songs again, but I also wanted to release five videos, and I have so much more fit to film as well. So I just I love this song so much. Um, it's it plays like three times on my playlist. It's amazing. So I would recommend you watch it too, which I guess you have already. But just in general, it was just I'm really excited to see the next one because I haven't watched listened to IZ1 in forever. Pretty much ever since they disbanded, because it made me too sad to go back and watch them. <laughs> Because I think I first discovered them in a variety show one day. And I'm like, oh, shit. They actually have a lot of songs and they're only around for like two years. And all their songs are really good. So I went back and listened to all of them. And then when they disbanded, I listened to their last song. And then I'm like, oh, now I'm going to sad. So I haven't really listened since. Like only when it comes up on like a playlist every once in a while. But overall, just not really. So I was super excited to listen to them again. And I'm really excited. So I'll see you in the next song. Like and subscribe to the channel on what you think I should react to, and leave a comment down below on what you think I should react to next. Like and subscribe to the channel for more content for me and then leave a comment down below on what you think I should react to next. And then you can also support me on Patreon for early access to videos, polls, so you could vote on what you think I should react to next. And also if the video is blocked or there's an active community strike, then I will then I will put the link up to that video on Patreon through my Daily Motion because I have a my Daily Motion has the same name as my YouTube channel and you can watch those videos there. For example, Squid Game is over there right now. So that's gonna be it. Thank you everyone for watching. I will see you in video two. Have a great day. Thank you everyone for watching. If you want to support me, like and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more content from me. And also leave a comment down below on what you think I should react to next. If you want to support me on Patreon, you can do so and you'll get early access to videos. There will also be polls so you can vote on what you think I should react to next. And also, if a video ever gets blocked or there's an active community strike against it, I'll take it down off of YouTube. And I'll put it on Patreon and I'll link it to my daily motion over there with the same channel name as the one I have currently. So time to stand. So just look it up and you can see all the videos over there. So right now, Squid Game is purposely on Daily Motion, and there's a 2 gig uh, maximum, so it's basically chopped up into a bunch of parts, but I made a playlist with it, and so you can find the links all to that in my Patreon. And yeah, that's going to be it. So thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Have a great day.